Hey folks, I'm Tiffin Glory, and welcome to part 11 of my campaign as the Russian Empire in Total War Napoleon. Or Napoleon Total War, I should say. Um, so what we're doing, we're going to deal with this army here. Under Sushi. Uh, so Kutuzov is going to attack him, and then come down and take out this army. We've secured Munich. Still have Stuttgart, obviously. Uh, we might have to deal with Guy Ambler. We've already... That's the remnants of an army that we beat before. Uh, but I would hope that the Austrians would take him out. But they don't have that much in the area. So we'll see what happens. Anyway, let's go ahead with this attack. And I'm going to fight this but I'm not going to record it. I just want to minimise the casualties. Actually, I'm wondering if I should group up all my artillery and just blast them to pieces. Anyway, I'm, I'm going to go ahead, uh, fight this off camera, and then I'll bring you guys back when we're ready to continue the turn. Okay, so we took just over 100 casualties, mostly from the Austrian, or the French 12 pounders, and Kutusov gained the Corporal in Gold Braid, plus one to command when leading infantry, plus one to morale in battles. So let's put that to the test by coming over here and attacking this army. Okay, similar size army actually. I think we'll go ahead and we'll fight this one. And just so that we do have a battle in this part. Um I was half expecting there to be an army coming in from the city. And they get to retreat across the river, it looks like. They were definitely on our side of the river, but we'll allow them that. Oh, they didn't, actually. Just making sure the river wasn't behind me. So the river is back there. That's one crossing point. And I guess that'll be the other one over there, right. Okay, so that'll be their main axis of retreat, probably. Should they choose to do so. So I'm just going to have the... In fact, no, let's have our horse artillery. Here, uh, did we lose any? No, we didn't. Okay, so that's fine there. Our foot artillery, I'll just take up position here. Uh, are you in range? You should be. Yeah, that's all fine. So we'll leave you around here. Make sure you're decently spaced, not getting in each other's way. Alright. Uh, actually, I'm going to set this up off camera and then I'll bring you guys back. Okay, so an awful lot of planning for what should hopefully be a minor battle. Uh, as you saw, we've got our foot artillery up in this small crest here to target the enemy. And I've given them a nice long line of <laughs> militia to shoot at here. And then we've got our Jaeger out on the right flank. I'm going to push them up towards this forest. And we've got some cav over there to support the Jaeger. The rest of the infantry back here is just going to hang back. Hopefully don't need it. And then over here we've got a couple of brigades. And our horse artillery. And some cav that we're going to push forward up the left just to cut off this line of retreat across the river. So, I should be good to go. Now let's go ahead and start the battle. We'll get that artillery on the move. We'll bring our cav up to screen the advance. And then infantry 
You can march up to there. You come up here. Okay. What are you targeting? Their artillery. Good. It's only six pounder artillery this time. And they've got one battery of twelve pounders. So, as I said, um, I do want to push our Jaeger forward. So you march up there, no loose formation, and the Cav is back here. If you just trot forward to there. Okay, they've lost a couple of guns from the six pounders. Hopefully, they're not doing too much damage on us. Let's move this cab swing around here. And this artillery, since they seem to be marching towards us, let's have you line up there. You there. You stand there, and this brigade come around to this side of the artillery. To about there. Okay, you and Limber. And you do the same. Switch targets, which is fine. Let's have the calf sweep up there, take them out. And we can probably do the same sort of thing over here. We should charge forward, take them. About position, you march down there. If you form line somewhere around there, you march up to here, and that's your reserve. You can come up there. Enemy general's dead. Good stuff. Yep, so you take out them. You get into them. And you target the general. Up here. I don't think you're in canister range yet. Let's pull this infantry back slightly. Over here, you guys switch to canister. Don't shoot at Will, shoot at them. The general's still up there. General's unit. Didn't realise it was. Um, 200 men. Of course, it's not a general, it's an actual cavalry unit. So let's have you. Um, no, actually, you just shoot at them now. General's gone. I have a couple of units chase them down. Let's put you back here after all. 
make sure they don't recover. There we go up here. So they're still advancing. Can you switch to canister? Yep, you can reach them. And I think they've actually broken now. Let's have our Jaeger reform. There are things here. Yeah, they're getting chewed up. Let's have you both chase them down. And the other two regiments just march to there for the moment. Switch to canister and just shoot at them until they're out of range. Over here, these guys are still alive. And let's have you switch over to there. And have you fill in that gap. Just to make sure that we deal with them. You can switch back to shot. You march forward to there. These guys stood. Right, will you pull back? That was unexpected. We'll get the Jaeger to come and deal with them. head back over. Oh, actually, let's have you switch to shot and target them. You and you. I'm going to chase them down. Target them. Just in time to attack there. And we'll have you go and attack them. You turn and shoot at them. You uh, canister again. Okay, and this, uh, these batteries up here, we'll just have them uh, limber up again. To avoid friendly fire. Let the Jaeger break these guys. So another unit just come back. Yeah. You come over here. In fact, you go up there. All of them charge in as well. Who's running? Are you in musket range? Cavalry than I should have. What do we have here? Lancers. Attack them. Lands there. Oh, 
go. I think that's everything. Yeah. We'll just end the battle. So that was a bit messier than I thought. Never mind. With 68 no lands. Genuine lost four. So they, uh, this militia didn't actually lose as many men as I was expecting. I suppose because the the infantry came over to the right to the army I was sending round to flank them on the division. Anyway, done and done. And now do we push on and you know, that uh, army there under Druey? Can also come back and support the force to besiege them. So I think we'll just stay where we are for now. Can't reach over there. Yes, I think we just leave these guys where they are. What can we recruit in here? Everything good. So, we've got four units of militia. I think I would like to merge them together. Any more I can merge that would be profitable, probably. Yeah, if we merge them and then just stick them in there. Okay, so I would like some more cav in the army. Hazars or Ulans? Yeah. It's got to be the Lancers. Well, hang on, how much, how, what do we have just now? Uh, we've got a couple of each. No, we've Cossacks actually, one Lancer. Yeah, so recruit me some more Lancers. And some Moscow Musketeers. That accuracy is slightly better. It takes a couple of turns though. And that would max us out. So that's fine there. And this army. I should probably merge up the Jaeger. No, we'll not wait three turns. We'll get them later. Okay, so that's our armies moved. Do I have a unit still in the march somewhere? No, I don't. We've got that repairing in Munich. Stuttgart, we don't need to repair anything. We're in good shape there. Do I want to go with the metal droids? I don't know that I want to spend that amount of money on them right now. We'll come back and see what we can do in our home territories. Moscow, nothing. Well, no. I don't want to be recruiting back there. How about in Kiev? Do we have mass mobilization? What were he searching just now? Trade unions. So yeah, we've got mass mobilization. We've got all that. So drill school in Kiev. I think is it Minsk is a rather recruiting area. So I definitely want to get to work on that in there. We could get the magistrate here. 
But I think we'll go for the hang on, that'll give us public schooling. We've already got public schooling. Um I think we'll go with the drill school here as well. We might keep the rest of the money for the moment, as long as the infrastructure's okay. These forward areas. Yeah, that's all fine. Can we do anything with harbours up here? No. Right, so we'll keep the rest of the money. Uh, we will quickly check out diplomacy and see if we can't get any tech from anybody. I'm not interested in them. Uh, Prussia. Pregions in the metric system. I've got that. Okay. I've got both. Right, that's given us the metric system. Spain's hostile to us. Uh, we're at war. Ottomans probably don't have anything. United Kingdom. Improved coppering. Not interested. Right, so that gave us, what was it, and the metric system, which we had been researching. Abolition of slavery, no, I think I would rather go with trade unions. We'll do that there. And the drill skill will open up these for us. Right. What about spies? Have we moved to spies? Let's have you... Probably just keep you where you are. Maybe just move you back slightly over here so that I can see what's happening up there. And you don't need you back here any longer, so we'll push you forward. And where are you, Timothy? Yeah, we'll just stick you into the uh, college. And with that, we can end the turn. Well, St. Petersburg, what can we build there? No, nothing really. Cantonment? No, no, I don't think that's really worthwhile. Ordnance Factory might be an idea. I know we do have... Um, Uh, somewhere is it in Kiev? Yeah. But if I needed to pull an army together quickly, we need three uh, recruiting centres, preferably. So we'll go ahead and get the Ordnance Factory in there. Just in the off chance that we suffer some reverse and we need, or Turkey decides to go to war with us, we need to get another army up quickly. Right. Finally, we can end the turn. You're going to go after... Oh, I thought they were going to go and attack the Austrians there. You're just letting them wander around that territory. I suppose it's my territory, so why should you bother? I 
Another agent. Another gentleman. Good. Another gentleman. And yeah, we've got a cav. We've constructed some roads. Lumber mill and great estates. Excellent. How much money do we make now? 9,200. Alright, let's have you push on beyond Strasbourg now. So let me move down there. Otherwise, seems to have left Strasbourg unguarded. Let's have you. I can't get across there because of the army, so just. I think we'll just actually leave you there for now. You're still recruiting, aren't you? Yep, another turn. So I was thinking about sending him up to take on that army while we attack Strasbourg here. But we'll leave them for now. And we'll have you march on Strasbourg. Alright. And. I think I'll fight this, but I'm going to fight it off camera. Uh, it's going to be straightforward. So I'll do that in between turns or in between parts. And I'll pick this up with you guys again after the battle. So for now, thanks for watching. I hope you've enjoyed this. Please leave me a comment, rate the video, and subscribe to the channel if you enjoy the content. And hope to see you again next time. Cheers.